Can we pull Magician of Black Chaos? Let's find out. What's going on YouTube? This is BMCool247 and today we have the Trials of the Kingdom. Uh, these boxes are getting more and more expensive. I opened up the cheaper ones and now I'm getting to the, the more pricier ones. This is like 55, 60 plus shipping. So like $70 at the end of the day. Um, so yeah, the Speed Duel boxes are getting harder to come by. I don't think they print a whole ton of them. <laughs> Maybe that's why. So, um, but I got my hands on one of them. So, and I want to open it up, of course. Switching back and forth between the TCG and the OCG. And the chase cards in this set, the dream is to pull Parasite Paranoid, which is a very surprising card to be the most expensive card in the set because it's just like an insect card. I mean, it's a great insect card, don't get me wrong, but the other variations of Parasite Paranoid are like, like a quarter, they cost a quarter, but this ultra rare version is like $15, which is insane. So let's see if we can pull that. Don's Alug is of course a very popular one in the GOAT format and it always has been. So that's why that one is second on the list here. Uh, Flood, Floodgate Trap Hole, Magician of Black Chaos, to name a few, and Haunted Shrine. Oh, Super Warline, that's pretty cool. Haunted Shrine is another, um, that's the, one of the newer trap cards, but it's really good zombie support. And I I read it and it looks real good. So if you pull that, I'll read it to everyone here. Waking the Dragon. Crazy Fish. Oh, this one gives special summon a monster from your deck or extra deck. That would be like a, a synchro, that'd be a synchro dragon monster. Uh, and then the sixth card that I haven't talked about is the Cocoon of Ultra Evolution. It's the only skill card I really care for because it it ignores the ultimate great moths. Um, oh, look, we got the fusion back-to-back -back force. <laughs> um, that skull guy, Black Patera. Um, it's the only, it's an easy way to get out um, ultimate great moth with, with Parasite Paranoid as a combo. So, so those two cards would be the best. Oh, here we go. We got to do it. We got to do it. These two make that. I've always tried making that when I was younger and I never could find Tainted Wisdom or Ancient Brain. But now I got all of them in just two packs. Oh, we got the ritual spell and okay. <laughs> I thought we were going to conveniently get these, the monster there. Let's go through these quick because there's only four cards and they don't give a lot of hollows. So another Skull Knight. Golden Ladybug. Um, this is card number seven or eight chase card, so that's a pretty good card to get. So that's a good pull for sure. One of the better hollows. Or yeah, I'd say one of the better hollows. I don't know how many hollows are in this set. Oh, Kairu Shin. Jurak Spinus. Flint. And Despair from the Dark. Very awesome looking and a lot of the artworks and a lot of the cards and a very beefy monster as well. Share the Pain, Giant Mech Soldier, Metal Armored Bug, and another Black Magician Magic Ritual. Maybe it's hinting at something. Really like these guys. I've never seen this guy before though. He sucks. Six stars at 1750. Still making trash cards, Konami? Just kidding. Oh, there's the War Lion summoning card. Change Slime, that's pretty crap. Teuton Mask. I mean, I don't think they reprinted everything. So, it's probably took out a lot of the normal monsters. Because you don't really run those in a good deck. Bloodsucker and ooh, ultra rare. So this is card number seven. Just missed the list, but this guy, I won't read the whole thing to you, but essentially it's hard to kill him. <laughs> He's unaffected by other monster effects. It, his uh, legendary fisherman number three is even harder to kill. 
So it's really hilarious when you get one of them out. Ooh, another hollow, Jurok uh, Star Rico. That's pretty cool. That one, oops, I'm gonna keep pulling from the right side. Keep the trend going. Another Super War Lion. Another Ancient Brain and Tainted Wisdom. Gonna have a play set of those soon. Got a play set of these. Now we got the Tainted Wisdom play set. Flint. I don't know what that is. Oh, it looks like it could be one of those, like, makes it so they can attack, so that's kind of cool. It doesn't make them insect though. I wish it made them insect because that'll work really well with the other the the skill card. That'd make it very broken indeed. Surface target one level three or lower fish, serpent, sea serpent, or aqua monster in your graveyard. Special summon in face up defense. can bring like one of those um, cards if it's destroyed by battle it would destroy you can destroy your, your opponent's monster it would be a really good defensive card I don't remember the name I just pulled it the other day oh we got time machine another ultra not the ultra I was looking for unfortunately because it but it is a very nostalgic one time machine Hopefully that didn't exhaust my ultras. I oh, was hoping for a better, better um, hollow pool there. Uh, equip only to a normal summoner set monster. It gains a thousand attack. You need you take no battle damage from attacks involving it. Ba bashing shield, pretty cool. Never seen that card in my life. It's got to be new. Yes, place it of those. And ooh, okay. I thought this box was going real south, but we got this guy. So, cover card. <laughs> Magician of Black Chaos. I don't think I've ever pulled him from a box or a pack before. I've only ever gotten him from a um the legendary collection set where he's obviously guaranteed so that's pretty cool that was the the game winner against pegasus pulling that guy out there we go we have the card to summon him pulling that guy out to to defeat i want to say it was thousand eyes restrict share the pain that was like prime Yu-Gi-Oh for me. Duelist Kingdom, beating Pegasus. Ancient Brain playset. At least that Ultra Bear made up for it. I was getting worried because we already got two Ultra Rares and that was the third. I was getting worried we weren't gonna get one of the one of those seven cards. And we did, so can't complain. Now if we get anything else from here, there's about these many packs left. If we get anything else from here, that would just be bonus. I don't know how many ultras are guaranteed in the box. Jurok Hera. Cool, more Jurok support. I had a mini drug dinosaur monster that was pretty decent but this is nice to, to have more of them <laughs> maybe i can make a deck out of it in the future oh we got a mako skill card dang it wish it was a uh, weevil skill card but let's see let's see what the mako one gives us 
Terror from the Deep. I actually got this skill card already from the the Kaiba um, shat, the depths of the whatever depth of the deep kind of uh, um, what do you call it? Booster box name. Dang it. Oh well. Skull Knight. Shore Knight. Salt on JHQ. General Headquarters. Nope. Nada. Bloodsucker. Nope. Yeah, we already got a lot of hollows. I don't expect any more. Dang it. You know, it never works. You never know if it will work or not. Tainted Wisdom. And last pack. See what we get. And whack. At least we got the cover card. Not the best box, besides, of course, the cover card. Got two Drax. Let me put Magician of Black Chaos on Frontier. Bashing Shield. Time Machine. Very nostalgic. Throws me back, you know. Uh, surface. Another Drax. Legendary Fishman 2 is pretty cool. That's actually not a bad card. And then Golden Ladybug as well. So pretty cool pulls. Um, not the ones I wanted. Definitely wanted that Cocoon of Ultra Evolution the more I talk about it. But uh, I still got the cover card in a minty condition here. Supposedly. And it has a little speed duel there. there. Alright. I do not have a second box of this. So that will be it for this box. Thanks for watching.